Okay, welcome back to XCOM. Let's see where we're at. Uh, exosuit in a couple of days, supply drop in five days. Um, thanks to an impressive number of screw-ups in my last mission, <laughs> we have like six people wounded. But uh, most of those will heal up within a couple of days, so we should be okay when the next mission comes around. But uh, I still feel pretty stupid about <laughs> the sheer number of mistakes I made last time. That was bad. But um, other than that, <laughs> we're doing reasonably. And, ooh, a scientist. Hmm. Not really my biggest priority at the moment. I mean, they're handy to have. I'm a little more concerned with making contact down here. I'd also like to get that finished off. That would be nice. Alien alloys I don't care about. So I think we're going to need that territory and that territory in order to get this and one more radio beacon somewhere. Hmm. Be nice to do. But uh, we're kind of low on contacts right now, so it's not something I can do at the moment. Now, do I want the scientist? Yeah, I kind of do. Avengers Let's grab the scientist. It'll give our people time to heal anyway, so... That... Someone recovered. Exosuit finished. Awesome. Let's go uh, get something else cooking. Let's see, we have three cores, so it's not bad. Uh, battlefield medicine. What is this? Uh, blah blah blah. It could isolate. It could it use our med kits. Greatly improving coagulation. Okay, so heal more hit points, basically. Uh, one core, two Viper Corpses, 50 supplies. <laughs> we are dangerously low on supplies right now. I think that would be a bad idea. Um, experimental heavy weapon. Uh, the rocket on the exosuit works fine. I don't uh, know if there's anything. A flamethrower. I know there's a flamethrower. I don't want it. <laughs> I don't know what else is in there. Um, let's, get a, let's get a grenade. Sounds good, Commander. Great. I'll let you know as soon as the project is ready for deployment. Awesome. Let's get back out there. Get that scientist. Ooh, lots of people recovering. That's what I like to see. Dr. Carl Schwartz. Okay. Awesome. I don't know what we're doing on research at the moment. I think it's plasma weapons. I could be wrong. Anyway, let's head in this direction so we can start making contact down here. Setting course for the Indonesian zone. I mean, we have four notches at the moment, but, you know, <laughs> every once in a while it likes to add two at a time, so... I'd like to be able to uh, get us in a position where we can attack. Contact. New ability, insanity. Debil debilitating telepathic attack that can inflict a degenerative or a different <laughs> negative effect. Wow, I'm just getting tongue-tied today, including mental control of the target. All right, continue training, by all means. Uh, let's see, stun a target for one turn. That could be hugely useful in the right situation. Uh, surrounded by an aura that blocks mental impairments for themselves and squad mates, also hugely useful. Permanently mind control an enemy. Damn. <laughs> these are tough choices. Uh, all of these are hugely useful in the right circumstances. You know, Psy operatives are awesome, let's be honest. Um, hmm. We've already got one attack that might give us mind control, so I don't think we need a second one yet. Um, I prefer to just kill the aliens, let's be honest, <laughs> rather than take the risk of, uh, you know, controlling them or, you know, failing miserably. I like the ones with the guaranteed damage. Those are awesome. Um, I like like the idea of getting stasis on somebody for a turn, because that, that could save a soldier's life. So we're going to go with that. I would like to train another Psy operative just in case for when he gets wounded, but uh, we have bigger problems at the moment and very low uh, <laughs> supplies. Otherwise, I'd be thinking about it. Okay. Incoming message for you, Commander. Patching it through to your quarters now. Yeah. You have made considerable progress against the aliens. Over New the staff available, Natali. I hope that your ongoing efforts will. He uh, to further <laughs> he did really well in my first uh, XCOM game until I got him killed, <laughs> which I still regret. I feel stupid for. It. He he will kick some alien ass. So we will have to get him some... Ooh. Right. Let's see. Supply drop by 50%. Don't care. 
armor, troops, don't care. What's this? One block to the progress meter. That I care about. <laughs> That's what we're going after when the time comes. Okay, supplies. Awesome. I need those. More than I need to be doing this. So we're going to go for the supplies. Commander will need to completely scan this I'm aware we haven't finished what we're doing. Thank you. The local resistance. I'd advise we stick around and I'd advise you be quiet and do what I tell you. Yours. Okay. I... Incendiary grenade. Ooh. I like that. That's awesome. Alright, let's get to the proving ground. Give them something else to do. Alright. Um, we have more supplies now. I could go for the, the improved medicine. I think we're going to do that. Interesting choice. I'll send word as soon as we're finished. Interesting choice. Yeah, our people are getting wounded left, right, and center. Why would you work on medical stuff? Alright. Do that. Awesome. I think we'll head up to the Black Market now. Actually, we might head to Staff HQ. No, Black Market first. That way we might be able to squeeze out a few more supplies. A little quicker. I don't want a mission to pop up while we're flying up here. Alright, let's see if we can sell some stuff. Stun Lancer corpses. I don't know what we would need those for. Berserker corpses. <laughs> Faceless corpses. Uh, we have a Mimic Beacon. I might need a second one at some point. Um, Advent Officer. Let's get rid of one of those. Sectoid corpses. Might need those. I really wish I knew exactly what each of these corpses were requirements for. There's not really anything I can sell, is there? Eh, let's get rid of a couple more Stun Lancers. I don't know what they're for. I'll, I'll find out eventually and I'll probably regret it when the time comes. That's fine. Uh, what do you got up here? Can I get supplies? I can. It's gonna cost... Eh, we're alright. I think we're okay intel-wise. So let's get some supplies. That'll be hugely useful for us. Okay, out of there. Let's head to uh, Resistance HQ. Setting course for the Indian Regional Zone. Okay. And what do we Welcome got? Natale. Sharpshooter. Uh, it's a shame. I don't really need another sharpshooter, quite honestly. That disappoints me. Um, engineer. I could use one right now, but I don't want to spend that many supplies on one. All right. Let's head back down here. Setting course for Indonesia. Don't worry, Natale. I'll come back for you at some point. All right. Let's see how much more of this we can get done before something pops up. Will likely prove crucial to our ongoing efforts, Commander. Okay. The aliens aren't going to be happy when they see we've got energy weapons just like theirs now. Ooh. I like that. Okay, big wall of text. Various other things we have and can now research. Scram gun, SMG equivalent. Uh, beam pistol, awesome. Rifle. <laughs> Storm gun, basically your new plasma shotgun. We could research that. Um, him, don't care about. Beam cannon, we can't do. That takes lyrium crystals. Okay, that would be the new uh, minigun. Plasma Lance, new Sniper, also needs Illyrium Crystals. Powered Armor, needs Illyrium Crystals. Okay. <laughs> well, I guess that's up on our shopping list, isn't it? Um, this would be a good thing to have. I think we will go with that. I foresee a number of valuable applications stemming from this There's low technology. intel, yeah. Trust I'll me, I noticed. Report assembled as soon as the research is complete. Okay. New objective added. Build the Shadow Chamber. Okay. Um, I'll get to it. Having developed a greater oh, understanding damn. of the alien's encryption methods, we can now construct a facility designed specifically to analyze any materials we recover related to their avatar project. I would suggest we begin immediately, Commander. I'm sure you would suggest that. Shut up for a minute. And...
reading you. All right, that helps. Regional contacts and we can located. get to here. Battlefield medicine, okay. Nice. Awesome. Basically exactly what it was supposed to do. We have one core left. Ugh. Um, hmm. I'm tempted to save that for another exosuit or a spider suit. It would be nice. We're out of Illyrium crystals, so we can't build one right now. So I'm going to leave this for the moment, which means I can reassign this engineer somewhere else, actually. Uh, where would we put him? We can put him down here clearing that. Uh, let's see. Scilab would be a good place to have him, too. Let's put him in there for the moment. Yep. That's where he's going. And, yeah, that'll do. Nobody's wounded, so I can move somebody out of the AWC, actually. Where do I want you? And there's a resi resistance comms. Unfortunately, I can only have one extra person. I would love to put another one in there right now. Why don't we get you... Well, who is this? Britt Maybe Anderson. Once okay. This is all over, Shut up. We should take this ship and go colonize one of their planets. Uh, it was you. Excavate that. There we go. Get a head start on that and move him over when he's done. And now we have one more contact, which is just enough <laughs> to get to this one. All right. Do we have the intel? Probably not, actually. Commander, as of 60 right intel, now, we yeah. don't have enough intel to get uh, a solid bearing on the local damn. resistance forces in that area. I'm going to have to go up here and actually scan for uh, intel. That annoys me. Setting course for India. But I don't think we're going to get to do much scanning. I think a mission must be ready to pop up right about now. I am sure you will Storm find gun. the results to be as intriguing as I do, Commander. Wall of text. Pause if you want to read it. Um, all right, check the shield bearer then. Physically, the Advent shield bearers are quite similar to the bulk of Advent's forces and that they are the product of careful genetic engineering that generally mirrors the human form. Most of their unique qualities come from a difference in equipment and armor. Components I'm sure Shen would have an interest in examining. Alright, he's got something to do, he's happy. To wonder how the Advent and Shut up, Tiger. get to work. Ah, here we go. I think, see this, yeah, we, we knew which one we need to go for. Um, no. Yeah, that'll be the one. And I guess a ranger. Uh, Alright. I don't really need a ranger at this point, but I'll take one. But the way things are going, I may need an extra one at some point. Alright, let's go. See what uh, we can afford to build for our troops. Really, you're not going to put my Psy Soldier in automatically? Because, you know, I kind of want one. Okay, let's get you out of there. He had one day left on his training. That may <laughs> makes sense. Why would he be finished? Why would the mission wait just that one little bit of extra time? Okay. Can't do any of these. Oh, you need Illyrium crystals for these. Really? Wow. <laughs> we have really got to get some crystals. Armor, there's nothing there. Hmm. I am disappointed. Okay, there's no point in that, there's no point in this, so <laughs> we have all these supplies and nothing to use them on. Okay, um, what did we get? Oh yeah, we had a new med kit, didn't we? Who am I going to give that to? Psy Soldier? Sure. Except that uh, somebody else must be carrying it. There it is. The Rangers got it. Okay. Why don't we make another one then? Build ourselves another med kit. It's not a bad idea. Okay, there we go. New and improved med kit. Might as well actually use the bloody things. Is he supposed to have... Um, he's already equipped with his uh, Psy thing, right? Yeah. Okay, just checking. I just saw it in the list for a minute and thought, have I actually needed to assign that there? No, I don't. Okay, everybody's equipped. Two grenadiers, one sniper, a ranger, a specialist, Psyop. We're ready. That's what we want.
Okay. Stealthily landing right in the middle of broad daylight, in the middle of an intersection. <laughs> we are off to destroy a relay. Alright, where's my ranger? You moving? Roger that. We have eight turns to destroy that relay. Ooh. The aliens may have cleaned up the design, oh. but these monsters are no better than the ones my father dealt with. Ah, not liking the look of that. Okay, let's get you to here. Understood. Moving out. I uh, <laughs> I was not hope not uh, not planning to and hoping not to run into an archon. Those will be unpleasant. They also have a shield bearer and a stun lancer. None of which I really want to see. Um, crap. We're going to have to uh, get people. I don't think we can get everybody into a position where they can fire this turn. Not well, anyway. We're going to take a shot at it. We only have eight turns after all. I don't want to hide behind a truck. I know how that goes. Who's my guy? It's you that gets the automatic overwatch, right? So let's move you to there. Solid copy. Um, that may only trigger at the end of his turn, though. I can't remember. You can't see any of them. That's disappointing. <laughs> that means I have to actually move you somewhere. Um, where are we? Probably best off going here. Heading there now. He's only going to get a pistol overwatch, unfortunately. I don't know, this guy. Right here. Thank you. <laughs> um, I should not have to worry about a grenade from any of these guys. <laughs> I hope. It's three missions in a row where I've been nailed by a grenade now, so it's <laughs> it's getting old quickly. All right. Let's see. You can't reach anybody, so you're on Overwatch. Eyes on the prize. You, I'm gonna hold in reserve. Oh, he could inspire somebody, could he? Well, let's hold on to that. You're gonna Overwatch. Roger. I've got my eyes on. You know what? Let's let's wait to see where they move. Maybe they'll walk right into our Overwatch. I'd appreciate that. Cubriendo. Overwatch. Got it you're automatically on Overwatch. Walk this way. No. They're just going to sit there. All right. Okay, well, I can't just sit here. Wait, uh, really? You're like, <laughs> damn it. Okay, you are going to go there. Take the heavy cover. We're going to kick off a fight this turn. See if we can get people some better cover. Orders confirmed. Moving out. Okay, good. Um, let's see our other battle work. Andando. All right, I think we might be okay here. Ooh, Scott may be about to ruin somebody's day. Let's do that. This area is mine. <laughs> yep, Scott's going to cause some trouble now. Uh, let's put you about there. Moving on target location. I'm going to put you on Overwatch. On Overwatch. Okay, you're going on Overwatch. Eyes on the prize. And you are going to start a party. Oh, you can hit two of these idiots. That works for me. The air console one I probably should be concerned about, but we'll see. Ooh, looks like somebody got a critical hit. Couple of armor points shredded, appreciate that. Come on, Scott. Time to earn your pay. That's the shield bearer down. How about that stun lancer? Can you take him down too? I'd appreciate that. Get back to work. Okay, Scott missed. But somebody else hit. That's fine. Scott's got another shot coming if somebody moves within his visual range. Come on. You can do it. Oh, here he goes. He's going to shoot at the... Uh, Archon. And miss. One for three. I'm not impressed by those numbers, Scott. You missed that? <laughs> He's out in the open. Damn. <laughs> okay. Not impressed. <clears throat> okay, I have you. I have the Ranger. Um, this, this is a Ranger that can reconceal, so it's okay to use her if I have to. 
Um, I would like the Stun Lancer out of the picture, <laughs> if at all possible. Uh, let's see, what do we got? Inspire, Soul Fire, Insanity. Can you inflict different... Eh. Let's go with the Soul Fire and make sure the Stun Lancer dies, shall we? Four to six. Nah, it won't kill the Archon. Kill this guy. I am not going to carry any of my soldiers through the mission. Guaranteed damage. Love it. That's how it's done. Okay, you. I'm tempted to flashbang that Archon, to be honest. I mean, it's standing out in the open, so... In, uh, does, is he not considered flanked? That's disappointing. I may be better flashbanging him, but... You know what? Let's take a shot on him. Seven damage. Didn't kill him, I know. I'm not sure what flashbanging him would have achieved, to be honest. He seems cranky, he's pointing at somebody. <laughs> he's only got four health left, so... Oh, he's running away! <clears throat> That's actually a good choice on his part. <clears throat> Alright, get my ranger. Reconceal. In. Let's get you moved up. Coordinates. Maybe we can take out that Archon before he gets to his buddies. Um, doesn't look like it. <laughs> hmm. Okay, well the truck's gone anyway. Right there is probably the best spot. The can you see him? A, a mech. Okay, we're, we're equipped for that. We have a specialist armed with all sorts of fun EMP toys. Including ammo. He's got the bullets and he's got an EMP grenade, so one way or the other, he's ready for that. Let's just get everybody else here moved up a bit. Um hmm. Alright, let's get you here. Heading out. Now, are we gonna trigger them this turn? Is the question. You can't really move anywhere useful, that's kind of annoying. Okay, get to there. Not a problem. Well, of course it's not. Um, let's see. Well, you've got the automatic overwatch, so I can move you further if I want to. Let's put you on the car that's already exploded. It's not much in the way of cover, but, you know. Now, has he moved? Yeah, he moved close enough for them to see him. The Archon is with that group. Unfortunately, he was the one that had the, uh, the EMP grenade, so I can't uh, undo the uh, <laughs> the mech this turn, unfortunately. Scott needs to reload. Uh, he's got a Mimic Beacon. I may want to get close enough to fling that out there, actually. I don't know that he can get close enough to make that uh, something they'll care about. Okay, let's get you moved up a little further. I could uh, inspire him, get him forward to, well, somewhere, <laughs> anywhere. It's not really any good spot to move him to. It's going to help, unfortunately. And he can't fling that very far, I don't think. No. <laughs> I don't know they will even notice it there. That's a shame. But, okay, what can you do right about now? Inspire. <laughs> That's about it. He can't hit anybody with the insanity because nobody's technically in his range. Ooh, wait. We can inspire this guy who could then fling his EMP grenade over there. Ooh. There's a choice. Let's try that. Inspire you. We will overcome. This is the kind of move that could actually make or break an entire mission. So hopefully this goes well. Anytime. No, no. This guy over here. This guy. Thank you. Um, we cut haywire. I want to. Ah, oh, can't reach with the EMP. <laughs> That's annoying. We're gonna haywire, I guess. Which may actually work out better. But Making anyway, new Making new friends. I'm sure that's the way they see it. I don't need control of him. I just need him out of the fight for a turn or two. Hundred percent chance. I like that. 75% chance to do that? Ooh. I'm going to click that and then it's going to go like an inch. You know that. 
but at 75% I have to try. And I'm gonna regret this. Ooh, I'm not. Holy crap. Okay, that's awesome. I'm really surprised by that, but okay. It works in my favor, I'm happy. That definitely changes the uh, battlefield. Anytime, if you want to stop doing your animation, it's slowing everything down. I appreciate it. Thanks. Alright, um, let's get Scott reloaded. Rock and roll. Okay, you... I might just put on Overwatch, actually. Because I don't think your grenade is going to reach anything now. Okay, uh, you're on Overwatch. On Overwatch! You, I would love to have somewhere more useful. <laughs> Doesn't look like I'm going to manage that. So I guess I'll put you on heavy cover over here. Ah, oh, she had a rocket I could use. Eh. Don't you hate when you notice these things like two seconds after you've told them what to do? It's alright, I think this will go well. They're either going to turn and shoot that, or they're going to run into my Overwatch. <laughs> What's the Archon doing? He's going to backstab him. Okay. And we have a commander, okay. Who's going to mark somebody, obviously. And probably going to shoot? Yes. And miss. Thank goodness for that. And that's a regular trooper who probably has a grenade. But is just going to shoot. Oh! He shot him. Well, we got enhanced med kits this time around, so... Alright, what kind of fun can we have? I, could I put Scott up on top of that thing? Would that even be a good idea? No, it would not. But it's not going to let me anyway. It isn't. <laughs> yeah, the bus stop ain't really going to help at that range. That's a shame. He's got a Mimic Beacon, though. What's the mech up to? Can I control him this turn? I can. Micro-missiles! <laughs> Is there even a question of what I'm going to do now? Micro-missiles. He could actually take out himself and the Archon. <laughs> <laughs> Is that mean? That may be mean, but you know what? Do it anyway. Yeah, I know. I don't care. <laughs> oh, the Archon survived with a hit point. I'm disappointed by that. It's alright. It all works out. I can finish him off with combat protocol if I have to. Um, you need to move forward and launch a grenade into somebody's life. Moving to position. I didn't bring my new grenade, did I? The incendiary. Damn. There's always something I forget. You've got somebody... F All right. That guy. Really? Hmm. Alright. Try the flank. Beautiful. Appreciate that. Target neutralized. Okay. And a promotion. A there you go. What else have I got? I got you. I would like you to take care of that commander, but I don't think you're going to get to a spot where you can do that. Um, might be able to rock it from here. If I can get the angle right. Go here. Maybe we can screw up her cover a bit. Present for you. That uh, didn't destroy the cover, but it did some nice damage. Um, not you yet. Let's see, Scott. <laughs> it's not really going to be able to do much this turn, unfortunately, because uh, after he moves, he's only going to be able to attack with a pistol, so... This guy, on the other hand, might be able to do something nice. Let's see, go here. Absolutely. And can't see... <laughs> Damn it. Alright, well, you're on Overwatch then, Overwatch. and you... Can you combat protocol? She's got five hit points. You can't combat protocol. That's disappointing. You can see it 40%, but that ain't gonna cut it. Um, and your EMP grenade ain't gonna do anything to her. Let's get this Ranger in play then. Can I put the Ranger where she's gonna do something? Probably not. There's really not any good spots I can put her either. <laughs> I should have planned ahead for that. Um, hmm, maybe I'll just flashbang. 
That might be a waste of a turn, but you know what? Who cares? Flash out. It'll be fine. At the very least, the commander is disoriented. Me. Yeah, we figured. Scott, if I can move you up, maybe to there. Absolutely. I don't think it's worth using a mimic beacon yet. You can go there. You, I don't want to lose, being that this is a hack objective. Is it hack or destroy? Destroy relay. Okay. I don't need to hack then. <laughs> but I still don't want to lose him. So. Uh, let's see. I don't think she can kill him unless she gets a really good critical hit. But it's not worth taking the risk. So let's move him to the heavy cover over let's here. Put him on overwatch. And what is she going to do? Is she on fire? <laughs> I'd appreciate that. She's going to run it. Oh, the Archon is. I totally forgot about the Archon. I'm an idiot. You want some more? Okay, what are you doing? You're burning. Awesome. Oh, shooting at... Oh, the Ranger. And missing. I'm under fire. You're fine. Quit your whining. Okay, Sniper, can you hit anything this time? You might. At 44%. That's unimpressive. Uh, I <laughs> you know what? Take the shot. Missed by a mile. It's alright. It was worth a go. Now, let's see. Not you. Can you flank? No, probably not. What's with the fire? Can she not move without getting lit on fire? Right, can you see... You must be able to see him. Stop doing that. <laughs> this game sometimes. Alright. You're gonna go... There. Here I come. I'm up here! Seriously? <laughs> These people sometimes, I swear. Take a shot at him. Okay, that hit. Graze, unfortunately. I don't think that movement should have lit her on fire, but, you know, what are you going to do about it? The game likes to do that kind of thing once in a while. You're moving up to here. What else have I got? You. You're going to move up to about there. Shall I try the insanity thing on him? I should. <laughs> that do anything? Uh, it seems to have disoriented her. Okay. I'm not sure that's really helping me much. Can you... You can't see the combat protocol. You can if I move you... Here. Might as well do this the easy way. Hi, got a present for you. <laughs> Goodbye. Nice knowing you. He's got a promotion. Awesome. Okay. You, we will move forward. Avoiding flames this time. Can we launch a grenade into the front door? No, we can't. Alright. Now oh, you'll have to wait till the next turn. We still got four turns. I think we're okay. There's probably another squad somewhere. But um, I think we're alright. You could blow the front off that building, could you? Do that. What she said. means we should now be able to see the thing. Yes? Maybe? And you're going to take burning damage. All right, well, she's got a med kit on her. She can heal unless she panics. <laughs> she didn't panic. I'm a little surprised. Okay, heal. Put out the fire. Thank you. Still find that silly that she lit on fire. All right. 
technically, I guess we can't see the thing yet. There's a shelf in the way, I guess. <laughs> All right, well, you've got another grenade. You can move forward. Fire another one in there. Destroy the cover and give the sniper a shot. Right? Let's do that. And I think we're doing all right. I assume there must be another pod somewhere. There we go. That works nicely. Anytime. There we go. <laughs> Game had to think about that for some reason. <clears throat> Scott, can you see that? You can. Awesome. Shoot it. Problem solved. Five, we've confirmed destruction of the relay. The alien transmission is down. Eliminate any remaining hostiles and move to evac. Okay, now comes the question, where are the uh, bad guys? It could be on the overpass. I'm hoping not. <laughs> it could be in here somewhere or just out at the back. Tell you what, he's got some um, scanning protocol. Let's try that. If they're anywhere near us, he should be able to spot them. No, those are civilians. Is that it? Didn't see anything else? Hmm, okay. So they must not be nearby. It did. The camera seemed like it wanted to move this way, so they might be over here somewhere. Okay, um... Maybe we'll head up the overpass. Not this turn, obviously. But <laughs> Let's put you here behind this cover. Here I come! <coughs> And get you an automatic overwatch. I still love that. I should heal him while I'm thinking of it. You um, get to the heavy cover. On my way. I shouldn't just assume they're in this direction and leave myself open on the flank here, but we'll see how this goes. You really don't have much in the way of good movement options, do you? Okay, you're going to run over here then. No need to ask twice. Good. Get moving then. You've done your movement... You haven't. Let's get you behind that. Finally. Nothing. Hmm. That's the edge of the map right there. So if they're over there, I'm going to be kind of surprised. I would think they must be right about here. I could be wrong. Let's get you up to Let's here. Does somebody have a battle scanner? I swear somebody does. Maybe it's the other ranger. It's entirely possible. Um, yeah, I'm thinking it is the other ranger. <laughs> the one I took out and left behind. <clears throat> Alright, well, it'll be fine. I'm sure. What have I got over in this area? You. Do we really want to go up here? Well, it's the first half of his movement point. He can always come running back down if he has to. And nothing up here. Okay, that's all right. I guess it could be on the rooftop, but it doesn't seem likely to me. Let's move you right there. You'll get your automatic overwatch. All right, I want to move some other people up there with him. Uh, you can go right next to him might be a bad idea. And so would the car. So let's go here. What else we got? You... You're gonna come over to the heavy cover here. And you're gonna overwatch. Scott, can you uh, grapple up here? You can. That's actually kind of awesome. Going up. I like that. And it didn't even cost him a movement point. Okay, you're gonna go here. Not a problem. Okay, Overwatch for you. You're gonna come here, I suppose. On the move. And keep an eye out. Covering now. And you're gonna keep an eye out. I'm on it. Overwatch. Something's falling apart. <laughs> but uh, they are not interested in popping their heads out. That's interesting. Okay. There's a whole other structure here they could be in, I suppose. 
I could just randomly fire grenades around to <laughs> see who pops their head up to see what the noise is. I'd rather not do that. Let's see. I haven't really got anything left to scan with, unfortunately. Okay, let's take you. Move you a little further. I guess we're not moving you a little further that way. <laughs> Damn it. You. You'll get the free overwatch, so you're going to head that way. If they're on this end of the overpass, he's in trouble. Ah! There we go. Three mutons. One heading for the roof. Hmm. Not one of them has put themselves in a good spot where I can shoot at them, unfortunately. Okay, you should be about here. <coughs> Not a problem. Ooh, you can soul fire somebody. You? Sure, go with it. The tissue melts away. Well, let's hope so. Only four damage. It's all right. Any any attack that doesn't have a percentage chance to hit is great with me. Let's see you. Um, can't quite get to heavier cover. He could get to here. Get eyes on these people. On He's got two grenades still, so if those could reach by any chance, which they can't, <laughs> uh, to get blocked by that, eh? Of course they are. And as far as the game's concerned, you can't see anybody. <laughs> you gotta love that. You're overwatching, I guess. Uh, Ranger. Uh, there's heavy cover here, so I think you're gonna move to there. Can you finish off, uh, not that guy, 25%, ouch, <laughs> damn, 49 for this guy, that's pretty crap too, but alright, take a shot, through a wall, 7 damage, not bad, he is nearly down, eh, looked like uh, good enough damage to me, Scott can't see anything, I'm tempted to lay down that uh, kill zone anyway, just on the off chance someone's dumb enough to walk into it, so I probably will. Um, where do I want you that you could fling a grenade at both of these guys? <clears throat> I don't think you can do that. Um, yeah, I don't think you can. Let's put him here. Her. Sorry. My mistake. You don't have any grenades left anyway. 25%. <laughs> Damn. All right, you're on Overwatch. Scott is going to kill zone this whole area. Kill zone confirmed. Got it covered. Did he only have one bullet left in his gun? <laughs> Damn it. Get him. Get him. Ah. Oh. That was crap. Oh. Okay, this could be really bad. We may be about to lose our only specialist. Don't do it. Oh, there we go. Somebody please shoot him. Oh, really? Scott, shoot the guy. There we go. I don't know who he was charging for, but I don't want to find out. Now, that guy that was heading for the roof is coming back down from the roof. Going inside, and... And he's doing nothing. Okay. You I'm worried about right now. <laughs> But, let's see. Oh, he's uh, suppressing somebody, is he? That's interesting. Insanity. I like insanity. He's the only one I can use it on. Alright, go with can it. You hear me? And? Disoriented. Eh, I'll take it. I was hoping for mind control. <laughs> Have him shoot his buddy, but you know. You can see 25% on that guy. That's not helping. Where's the guy with the grenades? Way over here. I assume he's suppressing her, from the looks of things. Um, you can move to there. That's a good spot. Go there. Heading out. And put a grenade into somebody's future. Oh, you've got a flank, do you? It's tempting, but at this point I think I prefer the grenade. And destroying all the cover. Hi, that's for you. 
Right in the window. <laughs> Suppression removed. What do you know? He's now got pretty much nothing for cover. She could probably just fire straight back at him and ruin his day. 72%. Go with it. Ooh. That worked. That's what I like to see. That's fine. Not worried about it. I don't think you need to move anywhere else. I think you're good. You... You got a combat protocol? You do. Let's just finish him off then. Oh, he's got an armor point. Will this go straight through the armor point? I'm not sure. It will. Awesome. Problem solved. Status confirmed. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Okay. Two soldiers wounded. Nine enemies killed. Successful mission. I'm happy. Alright. Gravely wounded. <laughs> I figured she got a promotion after all. Why should he get it unscathed? Uh, restoration or capacitor discharge. Send the gremlin to a location where it emits a substantial electric discharge, damaging and potentially stunning all nearby units. Robots take more damage. That sounds awesome. I think I will probably give him that one. Go with that. And you got a promotion. Uh, heavy ordnance, obviously. <laughs> Grenade gets a, a bonus use like that. Let's continue. Uh, we got two Illyrium cores out of that. That's nice. We needed that. We got a bunch of corpses. Uh, Archon autopsy. Okay. Hello, Commander. And we have a new Ranger. That's fine. And he has reduced will because he got rather seriously smacked around. Fine. A new soldier. Nice Mohawk. Uh, intel is low. We noticed that part. Thanks. Um, check the soldiers here. Okay, the Rangers got uh, promotions waiting. 17 days on our specialist. Ah! <laughs> Someone's going back to the AWC. Um, one thing I'd like to check, where's Scott? I was thinking on the flight back, we need to get more uh, ammo in his gun. So if we have an extended clip auto loader, I was actually thinking of a bigger clip. I don't want him to have a free reload. I want him to have like more shots to play with. So if he's on a... Uh, on one of his kill zones, he could have like five five shots to, to fire at these people. That's what I would like to have. Apparently we don't have any right now. So I'm going to leave that slot open for that. That's fine. Um, where was our other grenadier? Not her. Was it him? It was him. He got the promotion. Can I give him an exosuit? Did we make another one? We did. There we go. That will help. And let's see. Our ranger. What's the... Uh, rank on this ranger. Promote. Uh, Phantom, absolutely. Uh, let's see. That one, obviously. Running gun? No, I want to conceal. It comes in far too useful. Alright. That's fine. Predator, eh? I like the sound of that. Let's see. Now, I had, yeah, for mobility, which you would want on a ranger, so let's do that. And she should have a weapon upgrade of some sort. Auto loader or hair trigger? Uh, let's go with the hair trigger, why not? Okay, good enough. And, yeah. Anyway, things went slightly better that time. I did make a couple of stupid mistakes, but uh, nowhere near as bad as last time. So I guess I'm happy. I don't know. I gotta get somebody in the AWC before I forget. Um, <laughs> let's move you up there. Britt Anderson, that was? Yeah. Okay, you're going up here. Excavating that, uh, that spot can wait. We need our people healed up. Okay. Anyway, that's it for this episode. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll get up to more next time. I'll see you then.